I don't believe it takes a certain amount of time for a person to change. All right. All right. My name is George Jacob, and I'm sentenced to 25 to life under three strike law. I have been incarcerated for 23 years. I had two prior strikes that were burglaries at the age of uh, 17. And when I turned 18, I was arrested for them, went to youth authority for a year. And then my current offense was used as my, used as my third strike. I was charged with recklessly causing a fire in my apartment while manufacturing methamphetamine and possession of methamphetamine. I had a six-year-old daughter at the time of arrest. She's now 29. And, uh, I have two grandkids as well now. So uh, that makes me happy. There's a daily struggle in, in my life, especially when it comes to the three-strike law itself. Over the years, it's destroyed my, my relationships just through the passage of time. Um, it's been unbearable f for some of my family members, as well, my, as well as my wife. I've lost family over the years, which is difficult. It's a lot of suffering. It's hard. But I believe the intent uh, of the public in the 90s was to punish. I don't believe that is their intent today. I want to cry. I want to be with my family. I want to be a father, man. A husband. I don't believe it takes a certain amount of time for a person to change. You can change when you want. Change your mind in an instant. It doesn't take 20 years, 25 years to change. Just like you can fall in love with somebody in an instant. There's no time frame to fall in love. Why is there so much time to, to equate to change? I don't understand it. It's hard to wrap your mind around. Look in the mirror and uh, I've grown old, lost my youth, but I haven't lost my spirit. Sorry, man.